boom, look at that. It's Monday and we are live with a slightly overcast installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning. Today I'm going to tell you why you can't get rid of that old lamp you've been trying to sell. Stick, stick around. This is 7 Minutes in the Morning, where five days a week you get tips and hacks dedicated to helping business owners and leaders just like you find and break through the one thing that is preventing your success. And now, here's the host of 7 Minutes in the Morning and your results coach, Tom Rigsby. Hey there, everybody. Good morning. Welcome. My name is Tom. This is 7 Minutes in the Morning where among many other things we talk about how to start growing and enjoy the benefits of business ownership. Yeah, maybe it will rain finally. When you get here, whether you're watching live or on the replay, do as Catherine has done already. Leave a comment, say hi, hello, good morning, wave, where's the dog, whatever. Just say hi. That's really all I'm after. And uh, by the end today, by the end, if you've gotten any value out of our time together, I'd love it, love it, love it. If you'd give me the hearts, thumbs up, likes, stars, whatever's appropriate in the venue where you watch or listen. I say that a lot and I've failed to point out um, adequately that you can watch or listen to this podcast just about anywhere. You can even ask your Alexa to play it from TuneIn. So wherever you watch or listen, it's the place to check it out. Ha uh, don't even get me started on broken lamps. All right, so, as uh, with most days, <clears throat> a quote has started this thought for me. Limitations live only in our minds. But if we use our imagination, our possibilities become endless. So, I, you know, I, <clears throat> the, the lamp's kind of a funny segue into the idea. Facebook posts are not showing in comment. All right, I'll look at that, Joe. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Um, we put, I use the lamp as kind of a funny introduction because we have these things sometimes that we just hold on to and we're like, no, 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 no. I hate a lot of money, spend a lot of time, whatever, doing this. I need to get this out of it. And that's a constraint that we've created in our own mind. Right? We've made that. That's bug or something over there. So we've created that uh, that limitation ourselves. Right? And in, in the written part of today's post, I talked about learning to ride a bike or, or maybe, if, you know, flying is your thing. For thousands of years we thought we couldn't fly. We thought it was impossible. Yet today it's very not that big a deal. Right? So there's probably something that you're looking at. Well, not probably. There is something that you're looking at that you think, Whew, that's impossible. I'll never be able to do that. I'll never be able to get that book written. <laughs> right? There's this impossible perspective. And yet, as our quote of the day says, if we use our imagination, the possibilities become limitless. The only limit yeah, couldn't break the four-minute mile. That's a great one. And in fact, <clears throat> the four-minute mile is a great one because um, a lot of doctors had said there's a physiological limitation. If you run fast enough to break the four-minute mile, your heart will literally explode. So when Roger Bannister decided he was going to do it, he was like, I'll either break the four-minute mile and my heart will explode or I'll, you know, whatever. Um yeah, <laughs> that's the way I feel about it, Joe. I'm only breaking the four-minute mile if something's chasing me. Uh, or maybe somebody I care about. That's my wife used to run all the time. And uh, she'd say, oh, why don't you run with me? Like, I've run every step I'm going to run in my life unless somebody's chasing me. <laughs> but all right, so here's the point. Let me go ahead and put a wrap on today's thought so we can get on with our day. As you look at something today that you think is impossible, something that is not obtainable, or something that is outside of your reach, remember, it is your box that you've drawn around it. When we talk about thinking outside the box, it's your box. 
you can do what you want to with the box. And while while using your imagination to create the, the, the limitless opportunities, it may require difficult choices in order to implement it. But it's all there. Everything's on the table for you today. You have the entire world of opportunity to choose from. It's all your choice. So go out and make great choices today. If you got value today, or at least were entertained by the bug crawling on my neck, leave me a comment, say hi, uh, leave a, a thumbs up, a like, wave, whatever uh, is appropriate for you. Tomorrow, still feel like that thing's over there. Tomorrow, uh, I'll be back with another installment here at 7, and then the radio show at 8. Talk radio for entrepreneurs. You guys tune in tomorrow. I'll talk to you then. Have a magnificent Monday. Talk to you later.